Mojave County Legal Defender's Office. Please hold while I connect your call. Legal Defender's Office, this is Erica. Hi, it's Elena there, please. She's out today. Can I help you? Uh, no. Um, this is Dan. I was just curious about the case. Um, you guys had chance to review it lately. You said last time you didn't you didn't have much time to look it over. And that's the question for Elena. She's your attorney. Um, you can send her an email. I know you have it. She's out today and probably Monday. And I'm, um, she's sick, so. Um, but if you'd like to send her an email, you're welcome to touch base with her that way. She's uh, working remotely at this time. Okay. All right. Um, well, we're looking at the evidence that's been modified again, Erica. When you look at okay. when you look Daniel, Daniel, I'm not I'm not an attorney. I'm just the landlord. No, 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 I know you're not an attorney. I'm just so saying it's her, it's her to review that evidence and stuff. I don't have that access. So you're going to want to have that discussion with Elena. Well, I just want to tell you something. I just got off the phone with the Mojave County Sheriff's Office again, and I tried to talk to Sheriff Schuster's office, Amanda, and them again. I had spoke to him a year ago about this, and then now we've seen that the evidence that came from Ramos's office four months ago was actually modified again. And so, Dan, Dan, again, I'm, I'm, I don't want to sit here and say the same thing over and over. Is this stuff that you're going to discuss with Elena about? She's your attorney. I am not. Well, she's not around, so I wanted to give you the update. So, but you can update her on an email because you've done it before. We get your email. She gets them. She's working remotely from home. So yeah, but like you to told me she... an update about that conversation. Then send her a quick email, and she'll get it from home. Yeah, but you told me she called me back, emailed me back. She never did. Don't control what she does. I forward the messages. If she decides to reply, she decides to reply. Have you? Have you? Um, if it requires a response. Have you ever? So I w So Dan, if you have an update about what happened with the sheriff's office, send her an email, and she will get it from home. She's working remotely. She's sick. She's not in the office today or Monday. No, I understand. Have you ever seen them use modified splice body cam footages before and voiceovers in evidence before? That's a question for Elena. She's your attorney. I don't have access to some of that information that you're requesting. You need to talk to Elena. Well, I was wondering what you guys would do with such a case if it was that bad. Wouldn't you try and get it Again, dismissed? you need to have this discussion with Elena. She is your attorney. I am a secretary. I don't discuss that information. That's why you have an appointed attorney. But she's sick. I don't want to bother if she's sick. Well, send her an email. She will open her email when she feels better that she's able to. Okay. okay. Or you can okay. call back towards the end of next week. Okay. All right. Okay.